Okay. Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm Tianyi Zhou. I'm from KDH Royal Institute of Technology. And I'm very happy to be here to share our paper, Modeling the Impact of Timeline Algorithms on Pinot Dynamics with uh, using low rank updates. This is a joint work with uh, Steph Neumann, uh, Kieran Garimola, and Aristides Jonas. Okay. Okay, at the, at the beginning, I would like to share some motivation behind this work. So in social networks, individuals usually are connected by relations among them. Um, for example, like on Twitter, the relation could be uh, following relation relationships. And also we observe that in social networks, usually the individual have diverse interests among topics. And also individuals have different influence among uh, those topics. And nowadays, like timeline algorithms are key parts uh, on social media and platforms like Twitter and TikTok. For example, the Twitter for you timeline showed a uh, post uh, composed based on the uh, accounts you follow and the topic you are interested in. On the other hand, like you, users also have um, different political opinions on um, political issues. Like, uh, for example, many wrestling, wrestling fan, fans are conservative. And the uh, opinion dynamic models are uh, very popular tools like used to study the pol polarization issues on social networks. So here's the problem we would like to ask is uh, how could we model the impact of timeline algorithms on opinion dynamics? Uh, as a start point, we think about the opinion dynamic models, uh, which is uh, Frank Johnson opinion dynamic uh, uh, formation models. And we consider a graph G uh, equals VE with uh, uh, weights and uh, Laplace L. So each node's U has expressed opinion, um, the U in minus one to one, and uh, also uh, private init opinion as U also in minus one to one. And the intuition behind the FG model is that uh, how people adapt their um, opinions due to peer pressure. So individuals have uh, updated, uh, individuals expressed opinions are updated iteratively. So at each time step t, uh, the u is updated based on the weighted average of the expressed opinion of the neighbors and its own innate opinion. So at the end, following the updated row, uh, the equilibrium uh, would be reached, and the equilibrium expressed opinion z star equals to i, my, I plus l inverse times uh, innate opinion s. So note that if the graph uh, structure changes, the Laplacian also change and the equilibrium also change. So, but in general, FG model does not allow, uh, does not guarantee to converge to the consensus, consensus opinion, but it allows us to study the polarization and disagreement and how we define those uh, polarization disagreement. Uh, intuitively, we could um, uh, define the polarization as a variance of opinions where the Z bar is the average opinion and we could define the disagreement DJ as uh, the strength among all pairs of neighbors. So with these two terms, we could define the uh, polarization disagreement index as uh, the sum of these two terms. And it could be expressed as uh, inner opinion um, transpose times I plus L inverse times inner opinion S. So this is the term like, involved with inner opinion and the equilibrium uh, expressed opinion. So now we could ask some interesting questions. Uh, if we'll, uh, we are allowed to do some interventions on the network, and how does it affect the polarization uh, if the graph is changed, for example, due to the timeline algorithm? So to, to answer this question, we need first uh, to think about how we could model the timeline algorithm. So in particular, we uh, introduced the timeline aggregation, and the way uh, introduce two matrix, matrices, uh, x and y, and the x is a user interest matrix, which is obtained by the topic uh, MF based topic modeling model, and uh, each row of x is a distribution of, k, uh, of user interest among k topics. And the influence matrix y is, um, uh, is encodes information of user influence among each topics, and it could be computed by the percentage, percentage of tweets of each topic. And uh, in particular, x and y are both row stochastic. This means the summation of the row vectors of x and y are both equal to one. And now we have the observ observation here. If we multiply x and y, 
So at the user level, x, y, i, g indicates the fraction of the content, uh, recommended content in the timeline of user i that is composed by user g. So naturally, we could introduce the low rank matrix ax, which is uh, uh, which is a, a metric that involves x, y, and, and the parameter c that are controlled how many weights are in this uh, uh, matrix. So at the high level, this ax represents a latent graph, um, like, like it introduced uh, uh, some new edges based on users uh, and the influencers' common interests. So if we add this ax into the original graph, so this means we could use the low rank matrix AX to control which edges are added into the original graph. Uh, and the picture shows here, like there is a new edge between Tom and John, uh, which is uh, the new edge was created by the common interest of music and the influence of John in music. So now we could do the interventions by changing the user interest matrix X. So uh, if we change X, the low rank matrix AX change, and then the, the, we add the new edges into the original graph. So in particular, uh, given these uh, timeline aggregations, we propose two novel data sets with ground truth opinions and also ground truth user interest matrix X and the influence topic matrix Y. So the largest data set we've given is Twitter large with more than uh, 27,000 nodes. And this one is uh, almost 50 uh, times larger than previous public available data set. So given the opinion dynamic model and the way to model the timeline algorithm, we studied the problem of minimizing the polarization disagreement uh, with some constraint. Apart from the constraint we have of the row stochastic, we uh, put the element-wise lower bound alpha bounds on user matrix X, uh, user interest matrix X. So intu in, intuitively, uh, we are allowed to do some small changes on X that we can transfer weights from penalized topic to um, strengthen topics. But here is a huge computation challenge. If we revisit the object function, actually the computation of the expressed opinion, uh, equilibrium form of express, expressed opinion is very difficult because it involves the computation of the inverse of the uh, matrix. And in practice, we could use approximation algorithm, which is a Laplace solver, to uh, computer the approximate uh, expressed opinion. Uh, but actually here, there's a problem because uh, uh, we use the extended version of action model. So the Laplacian LX is very dense. And uh, so it's ended up with the running time of omega n squared. So what can we do here? Uh, actually, we have a smart way to reduce the running time to near, li to near linear. So we do this with the wooden barrier matrix identity. To do so, we need to rewrite this uh, expression of dx by three new matrices, which is composed by x, y, and the original graph. So the, uh, the new matrix u, v, are, uh, we obtain this u, v by stacking x and y in the proper way. And uh, so u and v are also uh, sparse matrix. M is if, uh, it's defined as a form that like, involved the original uh, graph uh, Laplace in L. So here is a question of uh, wooden barrier matrix identity. It turns out if we uh, rewrite the uh, formula of a dx uh, with wooden barrier matrix identity, we could get an expression like uh, this. And inside this expression, we have a lot of uh, um, M, uh, M inverse times S which is the place we could use the Laplace solver to uh, solve the problem. And then we design the gradient descent algorithm to solve this problem. And as the experimental result, we test with the different parameters. And we see that the GDPM could effect effectively reduce polarization <coughs> disagreement. And then we also think about a simple baseline, like transfer weights from penalized topic to strengthened topic. And the first policy we adopt is uh, to strengthen non-controversial topics, but it doesn't work well. So it makes our, us very curious about the behavior of the algorithm. And then we look at the column change of the, uh, of the, uh, of the uh, user interest matrix X before and after optimization. We observe the patterns is very clear. The, um, 
controversial topics are favored and non-controversial topics are penalized. So with this observation, we propose a second baseline to uh, strengthen the opposing topics, and it works pretty well. So as a summarize, um, what we do here is we provide a way to model the, the timeline algorithm, um, uh, and also we provide a uh, novel data set with ground truth opinions, and we provide an efficient way to estimate the expressed opinion uh, of the extended FG model. And on top of that, we provide uh, an algorithm to minimize polarization by transfer weights from penalized topic to uh, student topics. Okay, thank you.